Uh, and then in 1781, William Herschel in Bath, England, discovered the planet Uranus. Uh, and then 20 years later, the planet Ceres was discovered. The following year, uh, another one was found, Pallas. And then a year or two after that, Juno and uh, Vesta was found three years after that. So there were 11 planets. Ceres, Pallas, Juno and Vesta were clearly much smaller than the other planets. Then they found another big planet, Neptune. Now we had a bit of a, of a problem. Uh, there were, what, 13 planets by this time. Uh, but these here were clearly a bit different from the other eight. These smaller so-called planets were demoted. The term minor planet seems to have been invented at the beginning of 1853, the implication therefore being that the other eight are major planets. And I think that was a great step forward, quite frankly. Uh, in fact, by the end of the, of the 19th century, um, there, there, were, there, were, there were, what, if this works, yes, 500, 500 or so minor planets between Mars and Jupiter. All the little objects surrounded by other stuff became minor planets, also known as asteroids. The eight big things, on their own, were planets. It was that simple. One asteroid belt, eight planets. <laughs> 